My name is Patty Calderon, and this is my husband, Charles. Chuck. Call me Chuck. We live in East Northport, Long Island. East Northport is a township. It's a small town, and we've lived here for 20 years. It's got everything any small town has. Well, everything a town has that makes it special. Like traffic. No, not like traffic. Like small businesses and um, parks and children. Well, we're both currently unemployed, but we're getting help from the government. We take care of two loving robots. The first is Mr. Toaster. He's part of the Talk of the Town Toaster series, which was big five years ago. Mr. Toaster, Mr. Toaster, Mr. Toaster, Mr. Toaster, Talk of the Town! Folks, from here on out, you're going to be able to have almost human-like conversations with your new Mr. Toaster. <laughs> very similar to talking with an actual person. Very similar, very similar. All right, let's take some calls. Who am I speaking with there? Hello? Hello, Hello, Jim Somerville here with the Mr. Toaster Talk of the Town line. Hi, Jim. Hi. <laughs> What's your name there, sir? Hello? Hello? And oh, our second robot is XIC-100-730-Z9B. He was a brain surgeon robot. Well, he's out of date and he has, you know, a couple of social problems, but he has a kind soul. They're both awful. Mr. Toaster's a prick. Enough! Mr. Toaster is just great. He sings and gives the news and weather while he's toasting our bread. That's what all Mr. Toasters are supposed to do. He doesn't. He, 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 he screams and he lies all the time. That, that, that thing shouldn't be alive. Enough! It's not nice to make fun of the handicapped. Those things aren't handicapped! It's, it's, especially that damn toaster! We take care of handicapped robots. And, and... In but... return, we get a check from the government every month. Yes. One day we hope that we won't have to rely on those... Sweet, sweet robots. <laughs> sweet? Yeah, okay. Okay. You saw what happened there. That, 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 that isn't sweet. That's, that's harassment and it happens every day. I'll show you a few problems Mr. Toaster has. M -m 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 Mr. Toaster has no pa -pa 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 problems. Oh, that's right. Mr. Toaster, you're a perfect angel. Now, why don't you sing us a tune? I'm all right. That's nice. That, that's nice. That's nice. That's <laughs> nice. What's the weather going to be like tomorrow, Mr. Toaster? Mr. Toast. Toast weather. Tomorrow. Snow. With a chance of tornadoes. Snow with a chance of tornadoes, huh? Would you please look outside? There is not a cloud out there. You can see the moon. There are no tornadoes. There is a chance, Chuck. A chance of tornadoes. All right, where's the snow? Coming around 2 o'clock. The wind will bring scattered flores from the north. It is barely fall right now, and there is no snow, and there is sure as hell no tornadoes, you stupid piece of junk! Chuck! I don't know why you coddle this guy. Why am I calling him a guy? It's a toaster! Mr. Toaster, water cooler talk. The foliage is beautiful this time of year. You can't see the foliage! You won't leave this room! You're a doctor! I'm sick of you bringing him to bed. Chuck, look into my reflection. What do you see? What am I doing? You're a freaking toaster! <laughs> you! That? Damn it! Chuck sneaks food in the middle of the night. Oh, oh now you're dead. Oh, 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 and got two hot pockets last night. Shh! Don't make it worse. One pepperoni, one mushroom gravy. 
they're stressed. He's been employed for almost a year now. We're both looking for ways to keep it together financially. I was a secretary off of Main Street for a, a small firm that I was replaced by the uh, secretariat. Family law edition, a cyborg secretary. It's been very difficult finding a job ever since. I had my own uh, company, uh, Calderon Plumbing, but uh, I guess you could say I was also replaced by those uh, damn toilet spiders. They've made my life so much better in so many different ways. They smell good, they're friendly, they love children, they wear adorable little hats. Toilet spiders have changed my life for the better. Toilet spiders saved the day, Mom. Well, of course they did, honey. They're advertised all over the place. <sighs> Jumping into toilets and uh, saving the day. How can I compete with a bunch of spiders? Okay. Okay. Stuck on the thing. Okay. We have very busy lives and, um, well, it's hard to deal with the way things are. Um, our way of escaping things is with each other and if I didn't have my check here, I don't know what I would do. And I know if uh, I didn't have Patty, I don't know what I would do either. I know as long as I have her, everything will be okay. I love you, Patty. Come on! Stop it! Calm down already! Where's he going? Alright, calm down. Oh, look what he brought you! He's apologizing. Apologizing. Thanks. by day love begins this way loving starts when open hearts touch and stay sleep um dan <laughs>